Texas University of Pennsylvania President Liz McGill has resigned. A short time ago, in a statement sent to the Penn community, the chair of the Board of Trustees wrote that McGill voluntarily resigned from her role, but will remain a tenured faculty member at Penn Carey Law, Penn's law school. As follows McGill's controversial testimony on Capitol Hill earlier this week about anti-Semitism on campus, most notably when asked if calling for the genocide of Jews violated Penn's code of conduct, she did not say yes. In today's statement, McGill shared a message about her resignation. She says, quote, it has been my privilege to serve as president of this remarkable institution. It has been an honor to work with our faculty, students, staff, alumni, and community members to advance Penn's vital missions. The congresswoman who led the questioning on Capitol Hill of McGill and the presidents of MIT and Harvard just posted a message on social media saying, one down, two to go. And according to the Daily Pennsylvanian, Scott Bach is stepping down from his position as the chair of the University Board of Trustees. According to Pennsylvania Governor Josh Shapiro, who serves on Penn's board, the group was expected to meet this weekend in the wake of McGill's testimony. Senator Bob Casey is reacting to McGill's resignation tonight, saying in part, quote, President McGill's resignation allows the University of Pennsylvania to chart a new course in addressing anti-Semitism on campus. Casey goes on to add, the Board of Trustees and other university leaders must ensure that Penn's campus is a safe environment, not a hostile environment, for all students to learn without the specter of anti-Semitism, Islamophobia, or racism of any kind.